In Großbritannien, Frankreich. In the UK, France, and Belgium, the centenary of the First World War is proving one of 2014's major talking points. There are numerous TV reports and commemorative events. In the UK, tributes will continue until mid November 2018. But in Germany, the focus on World War II often eclipses that of the First World War due to Germany's lingering sense of guilt over that conflict. Euronews correspondent Rudy Herbert joins us from Liège. What's the mood on the ground a hundred years after German troops marched into neutral Belgium? The fact that so many people have gathered in the centre of Liège itself, you take as proof that the First World War is still firmly cemented on the conscience of everyday people. They expect a clear message from politicians through gestures of reconciliation, such as we have seen here today in Liege. But people also want assurances from Europe's political leadership that such disasters won't be repeated. Rudi, how is the First World War perceived today? I think as time has passed, there is less difference felt between the perpetrators and victims. Today, we have a further understanding of the conflict, that European policy failed and that millions of people paid for this failure with their lives.